Reuters North Korea murder trial suspects were wheeled around the airport this morning handcuffed, wearing bulletproof vests and under heavily armed guard. The two women were pushed around on Tuesday during a court visit to the crime scene. Indonesian city Aisha, 25, and Don Thi Hong, 28, a Vietnamese, are charged with murdering Kim Jong Nam by smearing his face with VX, a chemical nerve agent, at Kuala Lumpur's Budget International Terminal on February 13. Defense lawyers say the women thought they were involved in a prank for a reality TV show when they encountered a man at the airport and did not know they were handling poison. The two women were brought back to the scene as part of an entourage of court officials, led by trial judge Asmi Arifin and accompanied by over 200 police officers and dozens of journalists, on a visit to retrace the events that unfolded before, during and after Kim Jong-nam's death. Monday, October 23, 2017 A female soldier on duty in high heels defense lawyers requested the visit after video recordings of the women on airport closed-circuit television were screened in court. GMOI Soon Seng, City Asia's lawyer, said the visit was necessary to verify the surroundings and locations where the prosecution say the murder took place. The CCTV footages were taken from various cameras in various places, so from there we couldn't get a complete picture on how the incident took place, GMOI told a news conference after the visit. The site visit covered various locations in the terminal shown in the videos, such as a restaurant where City Aisha was seen meeting an unidentified man, the toilets where police witnesses said both women had gone to after the attack on Kim Jong-nam, the clinic where the victim sought medical aid and the taxi stands where both suspects were seen after the attack. Hong appeared unwell midway through the three-hour site visit while City Aisha broke down in tears. Both women were then provided wheelchairs. Defense lawyers later said both Hong and City Aisha were exhausted from being weighed down by their bulletproof vests. Reuters Indonesian City Aisha and Vietnamese Don Thi Hong are on trial for the killing of Kim Jong Nam recordings on February 13 show Hong approaching Kim and grasping his face from behind near the airport's check-in counters before quickly leaving. City Aisha could not be seen but was identified by a police witness as a figure running in another direction. The videos also show the women heading to separate bathrooms to wash their hands. Both women were seen meeting with two men, identified only as Mr. Chang and Mr. White, before Kim Jong-nam's death. According to police, the men had applied liquid on the women's hands, and were among four suspects at large charged together with the women for the murder. The airport visit comes as the high-profile trial entered its third week. Twelve witnesses have testified so far. Reuters dozens of armed police were at the scene of the visit to the airport forensic and chemical weapons experts said Kim Jong-nam had died of nerve agent poisoning, and that VX had been found on City Aisha and Hong's clothes. Traces of the poison were also found under Hong's fingernails. Prosecutors say City Aisha and Hong conspired with four others who are still at large to kill Kim Jong-nam. South Korean and U.S. officials have said that Kim Jong-un's regime was behind his half-brother's death. Kim Jong-nam, who was living in exile in Macau, had criticized his family's dynastic rule of North Korea and his brother had ordered his execution, according to some South Korean lawmakers. The hearing resumes in court on Wednesday.